dear friends in this video we are going to talk something about the ignition coil its function and its construction in the last few videos as we discussed about the working and construction of battery ignition system as well as the magneto ignition system so in the case of the battery ignition system one very important device is there and that device is nothing but called as a ignition coil so in this video we are going to talk something about the ignition coil its function and its construction so just in front of your screen here we have the actual model or actual diagram of the ignition coil so ignition coil is nothing but the coil which consisting a number of kinds of a winding so winding is nothing but the copper wire is wounded on one centrally placed the iron core so if you see over here the here is one centrally iron core rod which is situated over here and this rod is wounded by a number of turns of a copper wire okay so this copper wire consisting a secondary winding coil and the primary winding coil so as i said you earlier in that particular video also the number of turns are maximum or more of the copper wire in the case of secondary winding and whereas the number of turns are less in the case of the primary winding so also in this particular diagram also the small turns are there and this is nothing but called as a secondary coil or the secondary windings where the number of turns are greater than this particular bigger windings or we can say this is the primary so number of turns are less in the case of primary and the number of turns of copper wire are more in the case of the secondary so initially again here the primary terminal is there and here is the also the another primary terminal is there so here is that particular output terminal which is connected to the distributor system of the spark plug so again in this case what happen as the current which is coming from the battery say 12 volt it will come first of all inside this particular primary winding so the number of turns are less so it will enhance the voltage of that particular uh, current coming from the battery near about 12 volt will convert into near about 5000 volt as it will supplying or as it will pass from the primary winding so once it will passing from the primary winding then it will forward it to the uh, contact breaker as well as that particular uh, as we already discussed about that particular capacitor and that emf will back reverse back and it will come inside the secondary winding where the again the amount of voltage will be boosted up near about from 5000 to 22000 because of the current supplying from the secondary coil and that high amount of voltage or current will pass from the output terminal to that particular distributor system as we discussed in the last video itself so this is something about uh, the ignition coil so again uh, this particular diagram is uh, the actual ignition coil which look like this so as i said you earlier the ignition coil is uh, look like this one okay again this is in very according to the size of the engine according to the requirement of the engine the ignition coil sizes are there so it will look like this from externally it will look like this and its construction that is like the primary winding and the secondary winding like this one along with one centrally placed the iron core so i hope you understood the working as well as the construction details of the ignition coil so thank you so much for watching this video